Hey there, everyone out in YouTube land. It's your boy Mac, and welcome to Metal Lancer Gaming. Welcome back for my returning viewers. And today, well, I'm going to be playing some more. Yeah, you guessed it, Jade Empire. Ah, <laughs> oh, such a great game. Those bandits will think twice before. Th the only shame is that their ship sunk. Think what we could have done with their plunder. Ah, oh, well, that's another opportunity lost. <laughs> In this town, it's vital for a businessman to keep tabs on anyone with two coins to rub together. Things haven't been this slow since the long drought. That master of yours keeps things ludicrously stable while merchants thrive on strife. During the long drought, prices rocketed into the sky like fireworks. <laughs> Okie dokie. I can't say that. He's a wise man who sees to the heart of things. If I were to complain about anything, it's how few students he attracts. A skilled master could bring a lot of people into this town, but he is very selective about who comes. That's his business, I'm sure, but it affects my business as well. Alrighty. I get by. I suppose I shouldn't wish... F Besides, the bandits didn't do it. Happily, we don't need to waste time. I have nothing at the moment. Do come back. All right. Yeah, let's head to the school. I knew you would not let those bandits overrun the village. I hope I equal your skill someday. Please do not. This is the first task I have been given, and I don't want to get distracted. Okay, not a problem. What do you mean? Some sort of test? I... Wait, I know this. Yes, it's weapon, martial, support, transformation, and magic. Weapon and martial styles are pretty self-explanatory. Support styles allow you to paralyze, slow, or otherwise hamper your foes. Magic styles allow you to use your chi to control the elements, while transformation styles allow you to assume the form of creatures or even demons. <laughs> All right. I'm only repeating what I have learned in my time here, senior student, but that was one of the first things I memorized. Oh, good. I mean, yes, thank you, senior student, for the <laughs> chance to answer your questions. Oh, boy. Master Lee was looking to speak with you. Yeah, might as well go see what Master Lee wants. Who was that man leading the bandits? He was really scary. Eh, don't worry about it. Oh. Hey, look, it's a monkey. All right. Those bandits learned a hard lesson. Master Lee is not a man to stand by while the town is attacked. Same with you. 
When something has to be done, you do it. What can I do to help you? I'm honored that you should ask. What do you want? The school I attended in the Imperial City was becoming mired in politics, so my mother sent me out to the country instead. Politics is dangerous, she always said. His mother is a very wise woman. His politics sucks. I can't stand politics, man. Just, duh. Hey. All right. Oh, I don't know. It just seems like the city is changing. Strange people, strange machines. These are interesting times. I think she just wanted to hmm. know that I'd be safe. Yeah, ancient Chinese curse. May you live in inter interesting times. Yeah. Well, that won't be for a long time, but I'll probably return to the Imperial City. Perhaps I'll join the Imperial Guard. It's hard to think that far ahead. All right. Goodbye. Master Li does not demonstrate his skills very often. He must have been very concerned for your safety. I heard how you faced those bandits in the village. Many people are impressed, but I expected no less. Your skill is a match for any rough bandit. Is there anything... Yes, and the students are on edge from the bandit attack. It would do them good to work some of that out. Okay, cool. It is a shame about Kia Min. She holds the record for the most opponents defeated in my little training challenge. No one can challenge her record while she is injured. I have a little something tucked away for anyone who can best Kia Min's feet. That includes you, of course, but any attempt will have to wait until she is healed. Her wound was not mortal, but it was severe enough that I will not let her fight as she is. I suppose you could ask her if there's anything you could do to help. Sure, not a problem. Goodbye. To hear Gao tell it, he single-handedly beat back the bandits. But I know <laughs> you did the lion's share. Too bad I was stuck up here minding the younger students. It would have been great to see Master Lee deal with that sorcerer. We so rarely see our master's true abilities in action. I understand your training is almost complete. I wonder who will replace you as our example. It certainly won't be me. I can't even imagine Master Lee saying, you must strive to be like Lin in all things to the others. Just the opposite, more likely. Hmm. That makes sense. Is that how you live your life? If so, it certainly seems to be an effective philosophy. You could just be pouring honey in my ears, but that's not half as fun as other places it could go. Whoa, how- Lynn, you're incorrigible! Maybe I should spend more time training, and less time worrying about where I stand in the school. How else will I be good enough to take you down one of these days? Besides, there might be bigger things to worry about. I find myself intrigued by the ghost tales that everyone's mentioning. I'm sure you figured out... I wasn't the delicate flower my family had hoped for. They believed school would calm my spirit. Mm. But Master Lee has shown me how to focus myself. When I am done, I haven't really thought about it. 
I won't go home. There's no place for me there. If I can stomach the books, I could become a scholar. Perhaps I'll go to the Imperial City. I should see it at least once in my life. Leaving so soon? Oh well, back to my training. <laughs> Where's Kia Min at? There she is. You are the hero of the moment. Gao claims that he dealt with hordes of bandits, but everyone else agrees that you turned aside their main attack. It is good that you were here. My foolish lack of attention forced Master Li to come to my rescue, and left me with a wound that will take a few weeks to heal. Master Li assures me I will heal in time. It's a shame, as Smiling Mountain was teasing me just yesterday with some special prize. Smiling Mountain trains students in group combat, and just yesterday I managed to break your record for the number of opponents faced at once. All right. He teased me by saying if I could go one higher, he might have a prize for me. <laughs> I suppose he might make the same offer to you, if you're up to it. If I could fight, he could likely round up enough opponents for you to make a run at a new record, but I can't face anyone with this wound. Unless you can speed up time, I'm not sure there's much that can be done. Master Lee has already tended to it. Then again, I vaguely recall a grass or herb that hastens the healing process. Someone like Old Ming might know for sure. He's quite interested in herbs. Okay, I'll talk, go talk to Old Ming then. Not a problem. I think so, though I can't remember the name. It was some kind of rare grass, I think. I'm not sure, but if you had to buy it, I'd happily pay you back for the trouble you went through. This wound will heal in time regardless, but I wouldn't complain if it knitted faster. All the quicker to return. When he's not hollering at students for making too much noise, he's usually down by the beach looking after the statue of Emperor Sun. I know if I'm, if you, you're right. Take care. Go down to the beach. Our old Ming. Yeah, two rivers. All right, here we go. Sana <laughs> Really? 
e apa fawe e a kosa wi a toa. Yes. Then we should. Oh, hey. Let's go find the merchant. Should be right here. Hello. Yep, there he is. A potential. What can I. Oh, yes. I had heard that someone was injured and immediately saw the opportunity to make vast sums of. No, to make a difference. That's it. <laughs> anyway, I've uh -huh. checked my stocks, and I only have enough ingredients to make one dose of the salve for a poultice. I'm not sure how much good it will do by itself. Might take a bit of the sting away. Oh, now that's thinking, isn't it? Yes, I suppose red silk grass might be just... Expensive stuff, that. Very pricey. Hard to acquire, too. Would certainly help her wound, but I know something just... Get her some bearded tongue. If you think you can justify such opulence to heal something that time would take care of, mm. who am I to argue? I'll just need your payment to pre... An excellent choice. There you go. Her pain will fade quickly, and the binding effects of red silk grass will make sure she can fight again, if she wants to. Oh, cool, Your thanks. generosity is extreme, but who am I to complain? Enjoy, and I hope it makes your friend better quickly. Do come... School. This has been a busy day for us all. The sun breaks through the clouds when I hear news like this. Heavens, I can already feel it working. That's amazing. Yes, yes, this should be perfect. The poultice must have cost you some silver. Let me repay you. What did it cost? That's very kind of you. I can't thank you enough. <laughs> If you're oh, interested really? in trying to cool. set a new record for Smiling Mountain's special prize, whatever it is, then I'll be ready. I can only feed you answers that are common knowledge. Some of the other students might help you more. Well, wait. Wen is the most widely traveled here, and Lin hasn't been able to stop talking about ghosts, which is a nice change when we're talking about everyone else. <laughs> if you have questions about history or philosophy, I recommend avoiding us students. Learn about the past from those who were. Goodbye. Let's go talk to old Smiling Mountain here. What can I do for you? I am here to serve and trade. What is there to say? She tells me that she is feeling much better. If you wish to face her, I will allow it. Okay, cool. Kia Min says that she is feeling well and her wound seems to be already healing. I believe she will provide a fine challenge for you. All right. If you win this match, then I will have a special reward for you. Good fortunes. All right. Focus. 
is your I did the trick, hell yeah. Well done. As promised, here is a reward for setting a new standard. Kia Min is eager to try again, but I asked her to rest for now. She seems well, despite her earlier injury. Now, is there anything else you wish at the moment? I'm good. I think. Goodbye. Oh, nice. You fought well, and the record is yours. I'm happy for you, and couldn't care less about the record. It was just good to fight again and feel no pain. I'm a bit tender right now, but that's to be expected. I should be in much better shape before long. What can I do for you? Goodbye. Ah, you are back. I hope this unfortunate matter with the bandits has not caused undue stress. Some good people were lost, but many were saved. It means, however, that I must accelerate your training. These invaders discovered us by accident, but as you likely suspect, they are related to your destiny. Hmm. You have trained hard and are ready. You will have a pivotal role in some great events, my student, after you return from the spirit cave. I object! Gao, what is the meaning of this intrusion? Your pet student is not the only one who fought those outlaws. Perhaps I did not stand in their midst on the beach like a fool, but I did my part. If you spent less time coddling him, you would have many promising students instead of one. Hmm. This is not a matter that can be decided by effort, Gao. There are things at play that you do not understand. I understand that this student has received preferential treatment and I have suffered for it. Whatever is in this spirit cave, I am worthy of facing it too. Uh, if he is yeah, truly okay. better than me, let him prove it. I challenge him. I will not have you brawling in the street. If this must happen, it will happen in the ring, as a proper test of your abilities. No problem. Gao, you are restricted to styles that I have taught. I know the dark tutoring your father, Gao the Greater, has imparted, but I won't have any such sorcery here. Hobbled before I begin. Of course. How else would your precious protege win? My <laughs> student, I do not trust Gao to fight honorably. Oh, Consider man. your attacks carefully. Prepare yourself and return when you are ready. I'm ready now. Then let the fighters meet in the arena. Fighters, are you ready? This challenge will continue until one of you is incapacitated. This is not a practice bout. Injury is a possibility. No problem. A possibility. I think it is more than likely. Master, are you certain this is appropriate? They have a dispute, and this is the only way to settle it with certainty. It will be an honorable contest. I have restricted Gao from using his father's sorcery. I said you would regret getting in my way. Fighters, begin! Thousand cuts! Uh. 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 
You will fall here. All right. All right, I see you. That's right. Who's your daddy? The challenge yeah, has concluded that's right. and the winner is clear. No! I'm not finished! Gal, I have made enough concessions to you today. I thought I could guide you away from your corrupted path, but you are too much the son of Gal the Greater. You are no longer welcome oh among my students, and your father's house shall have no more business here, despite his influence. Oh boy. I was not beaten! Not by this peasant! You were defeated by your own foolish ambition and predictable temper. I will speak with you in my chambers about your expulsion. Go now. Everyone, this Which challenge bag. is concluded. I'm sure the victor would appreciate your congratulations. They are well earned. Enjoy the words of <laughs> your fellows. I will wait in the main hall, where we will discuss the spirit cave. Be certain you are ready when you come to me. Your life is about to change. Right. That was exciting. I'm glad you are safe. I knew you would be. Your skill is unmatched. Even Gao had to see that. I suppose that's what set him off. I hope he isn't allowed to stay. Punishment just makes him worse. Master Li has bent like a willow to accommodate him and his sorcerer's father. Yep. But don't you wish that some things made more sense? Anticipation is grueling. So much could be happening that you just don't know about. It scares me sometimes, all this talk of troubled spirits. I didn't ask to be a part of it. As much as you want to know more, I doubt you had a say in your fate either. I'm... I'm sorry, this is supposed to be a happy time. You've proven your ability and Master Lee is waiting for you. You should go to him. Okay, cool. Thanks. Ah, uh, there you are. Have you finished all your business with your fellow students? I expect our next conversation to change a great many things. You should be ready. Oh yeah, not a problem. Wait outside, Gao. I will finish with you later. Now, my student, there are many things ahead that you must discover about yourself. I trust you know the importance of your destiny. You are an orphan, but you were not abandoned. You were rescued from the Temple of Dirge in the land of howling spirits. You were orphaned by violent action. I take responsibility for it. You see, I used to be more than a humble teacher. To learn of yourself, you must learn more of me. I was once leader of the Imperial Army. I was known as Sun Li, the glorious strategist. I am the brother of Emperor Sun Hai. Hmm. Oh. I will tell you more, but first, we have an uninvited visitor. Gao never could keep his ears to himself, especially when angry. So predictable. He's heard as much as I wanted him to. Perhaps it will give him a little perspective. <laughs> he should yeah, respect even the right. most humble person, because who knows what lies within? That includes you and me both. Hmm. 
I was ashamed. He seized your homeland during the long drought. It was an aggressive change in the Empire that would soon bring Death's hand to power. I withdrew my support and tried to rally your people against the siege I had helped plan. A doomed effort. Many died on both sides. Sun Kin, another brother, also fell. Listen, I will tell you how you came into my care. All right, cutscene time. People were killed. I am haunted by it, and now the world may join me. The assassin on the beach was a lotus assassin, a minion of death's hand. More will come. Most in the Empire know nothing of the land of howling spirits. I found its people to be honorable, but I can't tell you more than that. There was no time to learn more. He is the right hand of the Emperor, and rules the Lotus Assassins in place of Prince Sun Kin, who was killed at Dirge, a death he may have orchestrated. He shows no hesitation, and gave no thought to the lives of those we faced. His influence poisons the Emperor. I have no doubt he is utterly evil. I okay. have never faced him, but I know of no one living who has. A dark energy sustains him. That is the armor of a man who has no remorse, no pity. There were three. Emperor Sun Hai, Prince Sun Kin, the Hand of Heaven, and myself, Sun Li, the Glorious Strategist. Age decided our place in the order of things. Sun Hai was the eldest and therefore emperor. I was next and was head of the army. Sun Kin was the youngest and leader of the monastic order. Your people were guardians, but we did not have a clear idea of what. It is tied to your destiny. I will explain if you want me to move on. You were meant for something important, but because of my actions it was denied you. Stories about ghosts, the assassin on the beach, you are tied to this. 
Alrighty, Our then. dead no longer drift to the underworld. They wander, lost, going mad. In time, they may overwhelm the living. It began when your people were destroyed. We are on the edge of the Empire, and not all spirits make their presence known. Yep. We are not immune, but I kept you isolated. This information could endanger you. Oh, the boy. first assassin found yeah. us by accident. Okay. The next attack may not be so unfocused. To fix the world, you may threaten the power of some dangerous people. The spirit cave will make things as clear as they can be. Only you are meant to understand what is within. You can see the corruption of the spirit realm for yourself. Okay. I got this. It is here in my home. I kept it hidden by never acknowledging its importance. It is not hard to hide something. You need only master keeping the secret. It was partly the strange skills of Dawnstar that showed me to the corruption, hmm. and partly something that belongs to you. You'll understand when you enter. Okay. Uh, well, it is thought that spirits naturally try to find their way to the underworld, but if their lives or deaths were painful, they returned to what was familiar. Yep. Okie dokie. The school has this. seen its share of tragedy in the past. Something of yours has allowed me to keep the students protected, but the dead will be everywhere soon enough. You must enter and see for yourself. You're right, not a problem. Good. Focus on that. It will keep your head clear. I know you are up to this task. There are instructions inside, and something that belongs to you, an amulet. When you emerge, you will know more about yourself and your destiny than I can explain. And you will better know your enemy. All right. Sounds good. Let's go. Take care of business. Hey, saving game. Okay, good. All right. Spirits go mad if denied passage to the underworld. They are strong, but you can fight them. You can't kill the dead, but in defeat they are disrupted and can't reform for a time. You are tied to the reason why spirits wander. Many appeared after your people fell, and some are held in this cave. They are drawn to your amulet. It is a head waiting for you. Be careful. It is desired by many seeking power beyond the mortal realm. I make no apology for these trials, my student. You will come to see how necessary they are. Oh, yeah, okay. The dragon amulet was with you in Dirge. I understand what it does, but you are the one meant to be trained in its use. I am sorry that my actions denied you this. Essence gems are used by healers and upstart sorcerers, and are common enough to be wasted on ornamentation. 
But with this amulet, you can tap their true potential. Sounds good to me. Your people were adept at using essence gems. I kept it from you because power is a beacon. The forces behind the restless dead will take an interest in you. Joy. Even mindless spirits may be drawn to you, just as they were confined here. In achieving your true power, you become a target that many will not be able to resist. Yeah. Thousand cuts. That's right. Nice. My student, I hope you realize your importance. The restless dead must be allowed to find their way to the underworld. All of us will suffer if things continue as they are. Seek the source of this problem and eradicate it. That is your purpose and burden. I hope that the basics I have taught you will aid you in setting everything right. Okay. <laughs> Not all spirits succumb to bestial rage. A strong will can transcend death. These beings may have powers beyond any living foe, and intelligence to beguile and confuse. All will suffer if the dead remain this way. Soon you must leave Two Rivers. Seek the source of this problem, even if it leads to the heart of the Empire. I have old friends who may guide you, but I have old enemies too. The cave is secure. Meditate on what you see here. When you leave, all will be changed. Ready. We will cook a beer in Takawa. Ukir weir, Uktarano Utak. No fantayana Ukonani Pinatawa. Uwotap. Wo Anania, if we were Uk Sonoro, Noka Uk Snapir. So I thought not Ipir in Akur beer. Okia, the paner nuko iwa ir, nika sanarir, iruru ninua sa ir kana. Yoko nikun kawashia, nikuona pifia. 
Sata tawe ia kuana ia suni ir ipodoki. Wo nawa fu kuno su kut ni awa fawa ia su tok. Oh, by the way, you know, hey, uh, if y'all uh, if y'all enjoyed the video, hit that like button, subscribe, comment, hit that notification bell, so you don't miss out on any content. Share with your friends, all that good stuff. Hey, let's uh, so let's keep going. Ukir wir, uktara no utak, no fantayera ukona ni pina towa. Oh boy, here we go. You cannot compare. <laughs> 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 Oh boy. My power is stretched thin, led away, and you are too small, too mortal to truly understand. But small things can move beneath the notice of others. Your master hopes that you will grow strong while he leads the predators away. His reasons are clouded, but you must find a way through the fog. You are the one who can hear, the one who can act. Search, but look also for yourself. You are a spirit monk, and you are the last. I do not have the strength to answer. I am cut open, and the way to the underworld is shut. Spirits are lost with no shepherd, no guardians. You must restore us. The amulet is a focus. It will guide you. But when you know both sides of the Veil of Death, ability alone will save you. Already then. Okay. I have a moment of power. A window to grant knowledge of a primal energy. You must choose between ice and fire, and I will grant the skill to bring them to your hands. I have energy enough only to instill knowledge. All right. Emotions ice. burn, but the spirit can also turn cold and strike with grim resolve. Command this, and you chill the hearts of your enemies. Yours is the power of Ice Shard. Problem. There is no inherent villainy in any martial action only in the hearts of those who wield them. If you rely too much on simple force, then you cannot act without it. I can do no more. I must fade. Pity those spirits that have grown twisted. You will come to know their pain when life leaves you. Oh, Pity the world okay. if you fail, spirit monk, for you yeah. are the last. I'm back. Yay.
quite nice. to work take care of business what are you doing out here you are supposed to be meditating on the amulet and what you have learned for at least another day A vision? Ah, oh, of course you did. A natural reaction to the great amount of information I have placed before you. It may have something to do with your amulet. Uh, tell me, did you learn anything about the destiny that stretches before you, or what has led you this far? Um... Be careful. I do not want you to be misled by sources I cannot anticipate. Your people had warriors by that name. I regret that my actions caused their downfall. Twenty years ago, the Empire was mired in drought. Your people revered the Water Dragon, so their Temple of Dirge was the ideal place to ask the heavens for help. But the Water Dragon governed more than just moisture. The drought was part of the natural order, and not for mortals to alter. The spirit monks denied us access. Boy. The Emperor was incensed. He asked me to plan a display of power that would force their compliance. As our armies marched, I realized how wrong we were. He could not be dissuaded. I fled with you as the rest of your people were killed. You must discover for yourself what being the last of your kind means. What else did this vision reveal? You are only to retrieve the amulet, learn to place gems in it, and meditate on your future. I don't want you to be distracted. Don't worry. Master Lee, there's still no sign of her. What? What is it, Wu? I'm sorry, my mind was elsewhere. Dawn Stars, I told you, Master. She went missing after Gao's men were discovered in the school. The state of her room suggests some sort of fight took place. Oh boy. I see. Yeah, time to go She's rescue her. No, Master Lee. There's no sign of her. I see. This may prove useful. Thank you, Jing Wu. You may go. Your appearance put Gao's disgrace out of my mind, but it would seem that your early exit from the caves has come at just the right time. I doubt she has come to harm. She is a strong woman, as you know. That doesn't mean you shouldn't search for her. It will be a good measure of your ability. What better way to show mastery over your abilities than to turn them towards helping your fellow seek her out? I doubt she is in the school, and someone would have seen her if she was in the village. You might want to try the surrounding marshland. How to do that? That is good. Time is very... You learned in the cave how single gems are viewed as trinkets and used by self-professed healers and would-be sorcerers, but you can unlock their full potential. Make sure you have everything you need when you leave to find Dawnstar. Do not cloud your mind with anything else. When you return, your course will be clear. No problem.
I hope dawn start it and leave the village. The path goes through the swamp, and that's a very dangerous place. Dawnstar wanted to be here when you left the cavern, but she's gone. If you ask me, some... I don't know where she could have gone, but when or Lynn might have some idea. I suppose you are looking for Dawnstar. I'm sorry, but I haven't seen her. I'm surprised you don't know where she is. I would have thought you, if anyone, would know. Are you sure she isn't off by herself somewhere? She's always been so moody. I'm sorry, but I haven't heard or seen anything on. Everyone's here except Gao, and he has no place here anymore. He seemed to be in a hurry as he was... Come to think of it, he was muttering threats under his breath. Boy. That's just Gao, so I didn't think anything of it. Oh boy. The gate at the center of the... Goodbye. I've heard that Dawnstar is... If anyone can find... Goodbye. Everyone's shouting that Dawnstar... Wherever she is... Good luck in your... All right. Go up here. Hey, monkey. Ghosts didn't take Dawnstar, did they? She talks about stuff like that a lot. Hmm. Well, I'm pretty sure, uh... Well, whoever kidnapped her is about to be a ghost here pretty soon. I couldn't believe it. He killed him with a single blow and laughed as this poor boy gasped his last. You! Gal the Lesser did this. He was dragging some sort of sack and this boy challenged him. Oh, boy. Crap. This brave young man stopped Gao and demanded to know what he was carrying. Gao just laughed at him and tried to walk on by, but the student challenged him. Gao just shrugged, turned, and killed this poor boy in one blow. Jeez. I couldn't say. It was awfully large and looked heavy, but I was watching from a ways away. We didn't want to get close to that murderer. We hid out of sight as Gao went toward the gate, out of town. Possibly, but we were too far away to say for sure. If you really want to know, go catch that fiend. Gao is in a rush, but you might be able to catch him st Be on your guard if you truly mean to pursue him. Gao's mad with rage, as this poor lad learned too late. Don't worry. Oops, wrong way, duh. There you are. I I hear your friend has gone missing. So sad. Very sad indeed. 
More importantly, my stock has arrived, braving roads dangerous with ghosts and bandits. A caravan runner just... What can I do for you? I just... Re have a look... All right, that'll work. Yeah, I'm pretty sure I gotta go up here. Oh man. It's a bit of a shame what happened to the guard here. The fool got in the way of Gao the Lesser. The young master oh, thought you boy. might come after him, so he left us here to slow you down. You were lucky against those bandits, but we're not so easy to push around. If you're quarreling with Gal, you're crossed very well. All right. Hey. Thousand cuts. <laughs> Feels like a war drum, and the battle did not go in the Empire's favor. Hmm. What happened? I, I was speaking with. with. Gow! That spoiled little noisy cricket! He hit me without cause! That repulsive. I wish I'd known ahead of time, you know, before he hit me. Yeah, no kid. Hit All me. right. No kidding. Gate guards, we're an unappreciated lot. I'm sorry about that, student. I truly am. I didn't see her. He was dragging a large sack, and I asked if he needed help. He said no, just the key to the gate, and then he conjured this ball of flame around his hand. I don't really remember what happened next. I might have passed out. No one's ever threatened me before. There's only one place he could have gone if he left the village. The path leads past the fields to the swamps. Oh boy, yep. Here we go. What, what did he do? Why would he resort to attacking me just to leave the village? Because he's a douchebag. What? That arrogant whelp? I trust you're following him to put him in his place. Oh yeah. Go on. Why waste time talking to me? Get moving. Sounds good. Let's go. I'm out of here. To the swamp. Give me a saving game. All right, you know what? I think that's going to be it for now. Yeah, that's definitely going to be it for now, guys. Quit crying, fool, or we will gut you like a carp. <laughs> Okie dokie. So, yeah. I think that's going to be it for now. So, hey. Yeah. Hope y'all, uh, hope y'all enjoyed the video. If, like, you know, like I said, if you, if you like it, hit that like button, subscribe, comment, all that good stuff. So, yeah. 
Y'all take care of yourselves. Take care of each other. Stay safe out there. This is Max signing off. Have a good one, guys.